Peace towns and villages across the region holding Memorial Day parades and celebrations. And today, thousands in town for a nearly 75-year tradition in Virgins. NBC 5's Carolyn Sistran takes us there. People packed the streets from the high school into downtown for the return of one of Vermont's oldest Memorial Day celebrations. For 74 years, people across Vermont have lined the streets in Virgins. A whole community comes together to honor the men and women who fought and died for our country. It's one of the biggest events of the year for this tiny Vermont town, nearly quadrupling in size for the day. We decided to put the chairs here because then we could watch it come out. Carol Maple's favorite part are the school bands. She missed the music most when the pandemic canceled the tradition in 2020 and 2021. It was sad. Yeah, it was really sad. People couldn't get together and they need this camaraderie. Parade floats taking on all different meanings. This is a mic boat. It was designed so that troops could be taken to the beach and not have to crawl over the side of the boat to get off. This group of Marine Corps veterans recreating a piece of military weaponry, bringing their experience to the community. It's like all things in history, if you don't remember your history, you'll probably end up repeating it. Commandant Daniel Bean from the Marine Corps League Donald Cook Detachment in Burlington says it's an important reminder of why the fallen had to fight in what they were fighting for. This is really an example of what we gained from all the efforts of the others who went before us. At the end of the parade, the return of this ceremony. A really important piece, a puzzle piece, because that really honors the true meaning of Memorial Day. The day's final tribute and an opportunity to give thanks for those who made the ultimate sacrifice. Organizers say the parade is almost as big as it was pre-pandemic. They don't have as many bands walking the route as they used to, but they're hopeful that a few more will sign up again in the next few years. In Virgins, Carolyn Sistran, NBC5 News.